course, we're talking about Connor. We got the man who beat Connor right here. And you ready for some questions? Yep. Okay. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Don't sound not. so enthusiastic. I was just gonna say, come on. Yeah. Ready or we're not? We're gonna have fun. Here we go. Damn. Logan asks, now that MMA is legal in New York, would you like to fight in the garden? In New York? Yeah. Yeah, that'd be cool. Anybody, All right. Anybody you'd want a piece? I don't know. One day. <laughs> <laughs> well, the juice asks, who would you rather fight at UFC 200, Connor, RDA, or GSP? Uh, either or. I don't know. No. All right. You got A, B, C. <laughs> Connor, RDA, GSP. You have to give an answer. More money. <laughs> <laughs> Whoever gives the most money. Yeah, Whatever. I, I mean, it's hard not to uh, uh, agree with that. Grabaka Hitman asks, after the fight, will you take Connor under your wing and teach him the ways of the American ninja? Hey, he should have joined a long time ago. <laughs> <laughs> I'm curious, have you seen the memes that people have of him in jujitsu class now as a white belt? Have oh, you seen yeah, any they're of going, those? They're going off. He shouldn't should have said that. <laughs> yeah, well, you know what? Fran Caballero asks, nunchucks or throwing stars? Nunchucks. Yes. Oh, hey, yes. yeah. yeah. You know what, Jean, you like Absolutely. Absolutely. Listen, be honest, I've seen him with nunchucks. You know you yeah. hit yeah. yourself in the head with those at some point, though. Everything. <laughs> <laughs> Everything. Be careful with those. Aurora Techers has everyone had a role model whilst growing up. Which fighter inspired you? It's OK, Nate. I know I inspired you. Don't worry about it. It's fine. It's fine. You and Gracie? Gracie family member? Uh, no, nah, I'm not always uh, Hicks and Gracie, Hoyce, Hanzo. Uh, that was my inspiration. Yeah. Starting trending in. I like, you know, Van, Van Damme. Absolutely. We're on the same page. We're on the yeah, same page. Yeah, so always. Battle Blade is asking, what's the most important thing you've learned from martial arts, not just for fighting, but in life, too? These are some serious questions. Yeah, yeah. Well, it's deep. Martial arts is just my life, so anything I know comes from martial arts. That answers the question pretty much. Yeah, well, certainly loyalty, I know, has been a big thing for you. Big time loyalty, yeah. It's everything. Honor, <laughs> yeah. nice. OK, well, Luke asks, would you ever consider fighting your brother inside the octagon? We sure are sure right you and Nick right are Come on, man. He says, loyalty is most important. You're <laughs> asking to fight his I brother. I want to fight Luke. <laughs> oh, yeah. Here we go, Luke. Nice. <laughs> well, very nice. Uh, you know, the thing is, obviously, it's, it's hard to separate you and Nick sometimes. You guys are so close together. Um, you know, you touched on this a little bit before, but do you think that Nick really wants to come back and take, like, super fights? Maybe you're saving GSP for Nick? Oh. Those are next fights. Those yeah, guys start offering to fight me. <laughs> Just throwing it out. Maybe. There. Yeah, actually, what know. do you think? Well, I think he's looking for the pound for pound best fighter. You're uh, talking about me best, again. You know, <laughs> yeah. So. And then, uh, yeah, I guess I don't know. All right. right. But would you like to see him fight Mike? How do you think that would go if your brother? Got... Hey, I'm down to fight Nick. I'm down hey, to fight hey, anyone. Hey, Stop hey, trying to be there. a stirrer here, Kyle. I'm just saying. I figure, you know, that's a fight people would pay to see. Did he make 170? Hey, he just his last fight was at no. 185. <laughs> <laughs> my my leg weighs 170. 